To get the command and the basics, we will solve the so many sums now. Today we will start them. Now given one sum is sin theta equal to 2 by 3. Sin theta equal to 2 by 3. He is asking to find all other trigonometric functions. Already we know this is the angle of elevation. Basic definition of sin theta equal to opposite side by hypotenuse. We will write it as A, B, C. A, B, C. Now, B, C is required in this case. In these modal sums, any two sides will be given. Third side you have to find. Now, here we need to find the side. By using the Pythagoras theorem, or right angle triangle property BC square equal to AC square minus AB square. AC square value how much? 3 square minus 2 square. 3 square value equal to 9 minus 2 square value equal to 4 that equal to 5. Therefore, BC equal to root 5. We calculated this value. Now, next one cosecant theta. That is what? Reverse to the sign. That is 3 by 2. Cos theta. What is the definition of the cos theta? Adjacent side that is root 5 by hypotenuse that is 3. Next one is secant theta. Secant theta means reverse to the sine cos that is 3 by root 5. Next one tan theta is required. Tan theta means opposite side by adjacent side. Now cot theta is required that is reverse to the tan root 5 by 2. Like that we can find the triangles the values. Here the sum is over. The sum is over. Next sum. Cos theta cos a equal to 4 by 5. Next one given it as cos a equal to 4 by 5. Again we are putting the titles A, B, C. What takes up? Triangles. What is the basic definition of cos? That is adjacent side by hypotenuse. Again we need to find opposite side. That equal to formula. A, B equal to root of AC square minus BC square that equal to root of phi square minus 4 square. Here only we can apply that formula. This is in the, this is in the form of A square minus B square. A square minus B square nothing but A plus B into A minus B. In that way straight away we can apply the formula 5 plus 4 into 5 minus 4. That equal to 5 plus 4 equal to 9 into 5 minus 4 equal to 1 under root. Root of 9 equal to 3. We found opposite side. Now we need the other values. Sin theta. What is the formula? Opposite. Here how much opposite side means? That is 3 by 5. Cosecant theta. 
what is that one reverse to the sign that is pi by 3 next one secant theta reverse to the cos that is pi by 4 here tan theta tan theta equal to 3 by 4 reverse cot theta equal to reverse to the tan that is 4 by 3 this second sum is over tan theta equal to 11 given 11 here theta is what this is we are treating theta is here 11 means you can write it as 11 by 1 what is the basic definition of the tan theta given opposite side by adjacent side now we will put the titles a b c here a b c now a c is required a c equal to root of a b square plus b c square that is 11 square plus 1 square under root that is root of 121 plus 1 that is root 122 here we will write that is root 122 Now, sin theta is required. Sin theta means opposite by hypotenuse. 11 by root 122. Cosecant. Reverse to the sign. Root 122 by 11. Cot. reverse to the tan that is 1 by 11 now cos adjacent by hypotenuse 1 by root 122 secant theta reverse to the cos root 122 by 1 here one more sum over here we will take one more sum sin theta equal to 11 by 15 sin theta equal to 11 by 15 this is the theta this value already treated this as a theta when the angle of elevation now what is the definition of sin theta opposite side hypotenuse we will type that title it a b c now we need b c therefore b c equal to b c equal to root of a c square minus a b square that is one root of 15 square minus 11 square here we, we did not to apply 15 square into 15 into 15 11 into 11 not like that this is in the form of a square minus b square you can write it as a plus b close it and into a minus b under root 15 plus 11 how much 16 26 into 15 minus 11, 4. Now, four into twenty six, two into thirteen. 
2 into 13 nothing but 26 only. 4 already it is there we written here. Now that is how much? 2 root 26 we will leave it like this only. 2 root 26. Here onwards we need the remaining functions. Next one. Cosecant is needed. Cosecant value 15 by by 11. Reverse to the sign. Now tan theta is required. Tan theta means 11 by 2 root 26. Cart theta is required. Reverse to the tan. 2 root 26 by 11. Cos theta is required. Adjacent side by under 2 roots 26 by hypotenuse 15. Now second theta. Reverse to the cos 15 by 2 root 6 26. One more sum is also over. We will take one more sum. This is A, this is B, this is C. We are treating angle is here. Now one more sum tan theta equal to tan theta equal to 5 by 12 given. 5 by 12. When theta is here, AB is the opposite side. BC is the adjacent side. Here this is pi, this is 12. Again we need to find hypotenuse value by using the right angle triangle property. That is what AC equal to root of AB square plus BC square. That equal to root of phi square plus 12 square that equal to root of 25 plus 144 that is root of 169 that equal to square root of 169 equal to 13 already we got it this time we need the remaining functions sin theta what is the basic definition? Opposite side by hypotenuse that is 5 by 13. Cosecant theta. Reverse to the sign 13 by 5. Cart theta. Reverse to the tan that is 12 by 5. Cos theta. Adjacent side by hypotenuse secant theta reverse to the cos 13 by 12 here one more sum over We will choose one more sum. Sin theta equal to root 3 by 2. We will put the titles here A, B, C. Here sin theta equal to how much given? Root 3 by 2. Here theta will treating this as the theta. What is the value? Sin theta equal to opposite side by hypotenuse value. Here we need to find 
BC value. BC equal to by using the right angle triangle property AC square minus AB square. That is root of AC value 2 whole square minus AB value root 3 whole square that equal to root of 4 minus 3 square root of uh, square root of 3 equal to 3 only now that is that is root of 1 1 here we need some other trigonometric functions next one cosecant theta how much cosecant theta reverse to the sign Two by root three tan theta opposite by adjacent that is root three by one cot theta is required reverse to the tan one by root three cos theta is required that is cos theta means adjacent side by hypotenuse next one second theta is needed reverse to the cos that is 2 by 1 1 more sum over here here we will take one more sum that is abc this is theta cos theta equal to 7 by 25 cos theta equal to 7 by 25 given. What is the basic definition of cos theta? Adjacent side by hypotenuse. Here we need to find other side AB. What is the formula? By using the right angle triangle property AB equal to root of AC square minus BC square. that equal to root of 25 whole square minus 7 whole square. Here also we need not apply the expansion 25 into 25, 7 into 7 like that we need not to do it. Why? Because it is there in the form of a plus b into a minus b. Root of 25 plus 7 into 25 minus 7 that equal to root of 25 plus 7 32 into 25 minus 7 how much 18 root of 2 into 16 into 2 into 9 two, out of 2 twos 1 2 will come out into square root of 9 equal to 3 into square root of 16 equal to 4 total value 2 3s are 6 6 4s are 24 now here we need the other functions second theta reverse to the cos that is 25 by 7 next one sin theta sin theta means here we will write 24 opposite by hypotenuse cosecant theta reverse to the sin 25 by 24 here tan theta 24 by 7 cot theta reverse to the tan 7 by 24 here one more sum is over we will take one more sum
this is a this is b this is c this is theta like that only we are taking next one tan theta equal to 8 by 15 tan theta equal to 8 by 15 what is the basic definition of tan theta opposite side by adjacent side here we need to find hypotenuse value what is the formula for that a b square a c a equal to root of side square plus side square b c square right angle triangle property that equal to root of 8 square plus 15 square under root that equal to root of 64 plus 225 that equal to root of 4 plus 5 equal to 9 6 plus 2 equal to 8 289 that equal to 17 already we found this value now the remaining functions are required we are taking cot theta here reverse to the tan tan given as 8 by 15 this is 15 by 8 sin theta opposite side by hypotenuse 7 now cosecant theta reverse to the sin 7 by 8 cos theta adjacent side by hypotenuse secant theta reverse to the cos 17 by 15 here one more sum was over we will take one more sum here titles are same a b c here angle is same cosecant theta equal to root 10 given cosecant theta root 10 root 10 and 10 that is nothing but root 10 by 1 what is the basic definition of cosecant theta hypotenuse by opposite side here we need to find bc value by using the right angle triangle property ac square minus ab square that equal to root of root 10 whole square minus 1 square that equal to root of 10 minus 1 that equal to root 9 that equal to 3 this side already calculated that is 3 now we need the remaining functions we will start with sine already cosecant given that refers to the sine sine equal to sine theta equal to 1 by root 10 cos theta adjacent side by hypotenuse 3 by root 10 secant theta root 10 by 3 tan theta opposite side by adjacent side 1 by 3 cot theta equal to reverse to the tan 3 by 1 there ends one more sum here we will take one more sum secant theta equal to 13 by 5 secant theta equal to 13 by 5 what is the definition of secant theta hypotenuse by adjacent side 
here also we need to find only AB value. By using the right angle triangle property, AB equal to root of AC square minus BC square. That equal to root of 13 square minus 5 square. Here also we need not apply 13 square minus 5 square. A plus B into A minus B form. That equal to root of 13 plus 5 into 13 minus 5. We can extend the root till there. 18, 13 plus 5 into 13 minus 5, 8. That is 9 into 2, this one 2 into 4. 9 into 2 is 18. 2 into 4 equal to 8. Um, out of 2 2's we can write one more 2 outside. Into square root of 4 equal to 2 you know. Square root of 9 equal to 3 you know. That is 2 2's are 4. 4 3's are 12. This side equal to 12. Now we need other values. We will start with cos theta. Why already second theta given? Cos theta equal to? Pi by 13. Sin theta equal to 12 by 13. Cosecant theta equal to 13 by 12. Tan theta equal to 12 by 5. Again, cot theta equal to 5 by 12. Here, one more sum over. We will take one more sum. This is A, this is B, this is C. Cot theta equal to twelve by five given. What is the basic definition of cot theta? Adjacent side by hypotenuse. Here we need to find this now hypotenuse AC equal to by using the right angle triangle property AB square plus BC square that equal to 5 square plus 12 square under root that is 25 plus 144 here we don't have any chance to apply a plus b into a minus b this is plus for that reason we can't apply now root of 169 that equal to 13 we found already this one now remaining trigonometric functions will start with 10 already cut given tan theta equal to reverse to the cut pi by 12 sin theta equal to pi by 13 cosecant theta equal to reverse to the sin that is 13 by 5 Next one cos theta equal to adjacent side by hypotenuse. Second theta equal to reverse to the cos that is 13 by 12. 